for your tutorial or other experiment. So I say again, very quick one, uh, aircraft. Okay, your aerofoil. Your main engine gear, your nose landing gear, your data. Okay, free body diagram I always want to see. Because it gives me an idea whether you know what you are doing or don't know what you are doing. Okay, so basically here, to here is your data drive. It's about zero, so basically let's say for example I don't want to Right? My weight of my aircraft at CG gear location basically is coming down. Weight of aircraft core weight. Okay? My main landing gear is here going up and reactionary load here also going up. This is my nose landing gear and this is my main landing gear. Okay? Yes. Okay? Yes. Nose landing gear will be given because it's also designed, I would know what is this location, where is the location? Part of the aircraft design. Okay? Main landing gear, remember, left landing gear act with right landing gear to form your total weight of main landing gear. Don't forget, sometimes I ask you uh, averaging. Okay, so get your average before you do it. Uh. So basically, it's also main landing gear is known as aircraft design, so here will be given as B. Or given a figure. That's it, uh. right? Weight of the aircraft usually is the total weight of uh, those standing gear and main landing gear. Right? If it's not given. If it's given, then you will use the given figure. Right? And this is by far likelihood not, not given. Why? Because you are supposed to find the CG. Okay? Okay? So there may be other weights involved. Uh, so if there's other weight involved, point downwards. So what I want you to do is always summation of moments about O equals to zero. So maybe uh, clockwise is a plus. Okay, so basically here weight times don't know what is equals to no standing gear times A plus main landing gear times B. Right? And whatever component, uh, the component going down is just at the side. Component pointing up to go up. But no component weight goes up. Component weight comes down. Okay? Then you will shift your CG location around. Okay? Yes. Okay, with that itself, confirm I will be able to get my CG location. This is what we call the CG, yeah? Okay? Okay, let me draw this thing up here. Here basically will be given an FS station. Here will be given an FS station. Say for example 100, 250, say for example. Uh. Right, so I bring this whole thing up to this side here. Uh. So the whole airport is up there. Say for example CG location. Right, here is a 100 location, here is 250 location. Here we found, say for example, 150, say for example. Okay, from all this calculation, you get 150. So, here to here basically is 100%. Here to here proportionate is what? Okay, so basically 150 minus 100 divided by 250 or minus 100 times 100 percent this is your MAC calculation simple question for anybody with any problem can anybody with any problem understanding MAC means mean aerodynamic cost usually what we call is L-E-M-A-C leading edge main mean aerodynamic cost mean aerodynamic cost means this exact straight line to here FOF covered. FOF? Yes, FOF covered. Now I'm using it. Application of FOF. Anybody got any issue at this point? Oh, okay. Then? Okay. Is CG out of what? Is CG out of what? Remember your assignment question? Okay, is CG out? How you shift the CG back inside? Think about it. Cool. Blue, blue tag. <laughs> we learn to put blue tag.